All right then, time for episode three. Welcome back, guys, and today we are back in Subnautica. Um, last time we saw an island that we weren't supposed to see yet, and we managed to get all the way to this island here. So what we're gonna do today is explore this magnificent floating rock with all its little secrets and then we'll see what the story holds for us. I'm not quite sure how deep it goes underneath here but our first goal is to find a place where we can dock our... is it the sea moth? I think it was called the sea moth. Uh, that should do it. That should do fine. There we go, you better stay here and let's see. First I want to get to a research facility. One like that, but a little bigger. Yeah, that's it. That's the one I'm looking for. So let's quickly explore everything here. There's quite a couple of things. Alright, and there are quite a lot of things in here too as far as I remember. We will just need to find everything. Wall planter. Interesting. Man, those things are really tricky to hit. Should be dead now. Alright. We don't need the microscope. That's non-functional. There we go. But I think that's pretty much everything we have right around here. So, oh, that's very close. That move. Yeah, that's scary. Alright, um, next up, let's quickly head to those mountaintops. I think there are two different ones where there's a little facility up there. So let's check out this one, because it's closer. Yeah, that's the other one. Ooh, water. That's going to be good. Another PDA. Alright, I think that's been that one, right? Ooh, what's that? Spotlight. Ooh. Let's head to the other one, and then we can go further along. Alright, let's see. That should be food, right? Indeed. Alright, we should have scanned everything now. So, let's head down to that marker. Alright. Maybe if that's actually important though. Integrating new PDA data. Huh? Okay. I think we've basically done everything we needed to here. So let's head back to our Seamoth and that's our run. Right? Yeah. And then let's head back, listen to the radio, and see what else we need to do. Alright, glad to be back. Let's see what we have. What's it gonna say? This is Life Pod 4. We've landed close to the Aurora. Flotation device is active, but we've got some big old fish in the water with us. I don't know how long we're gonna last. We're close to the crash site, so bring radiation protection. Four out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. Ooh. Apparently we have a lot of different modules we can build for our Seamoth. I'm gonna have a look at those in a second and see which ones we want to have. Alright, to be honest, I have pretty much no idea what I'm actually supposed to do right now. Um, so I guess I'm just gonna move along and try to do a couple of things. For example, um, where is it? 
yeah, I'm gonna start building a habitat now. So we're gonna pin that recipe and see what we need for that. One of those already. Uh, what do we need for that? Copper wire. All right, now we should have everything we need for that. So in theory, I should be able to start making myself. What's that? Interesting. Well, that's not what I'm here for. I want my habitat builder, and we are going to see what we need for that. Oh, we've got a signal. Let's hear what anyone has to say. Message from Aurora Live Pod 13 coordinates attached. Live Pod is carrying high priority passenger. Yoki Kassar. I said Kassar. Why do I have to record this anyway? Send immediate burial detail. Signal location uploaded to PDA. That, frankly, really doesn't sound good. But I guess we can uh, start building one tiny thing here. Interesting. Um, I guess I'm I'm gonna start with uh, with a thing like that. Okay. Interesting. And then I should probably be able to add things like ah, there we have it, a hatch. Can I add it to the top? I can indeed. I need quartz for that. Quartz and titanium. What do I have in my inventory? Enough titanium and not enough quartz. And another invoice. Alright. This is Life Pod 6. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to data bank. Again, a very positive Warning. Emergency message. Warning. Emergency power that. only. Oxygen um, production offline. We need something to power this something to give us oxygen how do we do that solar thing might be of a quite useful um, help okay apparently i can put that basically anywhere Interesting. I don't know if they move, but I'm just gonna add a second one. And I'm not sure what I need. Probably more quartz, yes, indeed. Alright, we have a little bit of quartz now, so we should be able to finish this. There we go. Is that enough to power this in here? No, because it's night, so yeah, we'll see what else we can do. I would really, really like a modification chamber. So, I'm gonna pin that, and I think the diamond might be the most uh, important part of that. Now we're gonna have to get another radio signal. I'm getting a lot of those, probably because we've kind of skipped a step, but we'll see. All right, what do you have to say? Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. Sunbeam. We have a landing site oh, right. for you. That's that's well, it's better than the alternatives. We've sent you the coordinates. It'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit. Should be able to establish direct contact with you during that time. Then we're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers, the weather holds. Don't leave us waiting. Sunbeam out. Okay. Um, I guess we should probably... Power restored. 
Oh, it's got Umbrella again, apparently. So, nice. All right. Um, Sunbeam landing site. Life pod 13. And was that the other one? I think so, yes. So, let's head to Life pod 13 Captain. and let's see what they have in store for us. Carrying high priority passengers remains. That sounds unpleasant. Might have been that we've already been here. All right. Integrating new PDA data. I'm not seeing any human remains, so that's a relief. Um, but I don't think there's anything else around here. I guess. Let's just go there, I guess. Don't think we're gonna find any diamonds soon enough for the module before that. Oops, got a little distracted there. Alright, seems like we are actually at the island again. The actual one, the one with a ground. Um, and I'm not sure what that means for us. With a little bit of luck, we can actually locate some diamonds before. Or whatever that is. What are you? Nuclear reactor. Okay. Interesting. Let's see what I can find. Oh, how did I miss that? Um, I did not expect that. Okay then. Seek fluid intake. Fluid intake. Don't have anything with me. That's a problem. Landing site right there. Okay. I think I just have to be there when the sunbeam arrives. But let's have a little look at that interesting structure. Okay. In interesting. I don't even know if I'm supposed to get in somehow. At least I don't really see any way in. But it doesn't look very friendly to me. You know what? I'm just gonna head back to our life pod and we're just we're just gonna wait and see what this thing holds for us and what we can do. Also get some fluid because I'm running really low on that, but otherwise I don't really think we can do anything here. So let's head back. Okay, at least I only take damage and don't die immediately, because that would have been really bad. But like that we can regenerate and we will be okay. It's a lot of damage, though. Okay, let me quickly make one of those things here. And especially quickly uh, use that. Okay, that's gonna give us a little bit. And that's gonna give us a little water as well. Alright, we are okay. Vital signs stabilizing. All right. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna try and uh, get a little bit stabler, a little more stable. Um, 
and see what we can do until the sunbeam arrives. Okie dokie, I've got a little bit of everything now. I think I'm gonna make one more of those peepers. But and then I'm pretty much stable and have everything we need to get going. So, 15 minutes until the sunbeam arrives. Let's quickly head over there to the landing site and... Where's it? There it is. Barely visible. <laughs> okay, let's head over there. We're probably gonna take less than 15 minutes, but... Oh, sorry. We can technically um, have a look at the island and explore a little bit. I don't think there will be much, but at least we can have a look at if we find anything interesting, maybe even a diamond. Because, as far as I remember, we needed one of those. It's been a couple of days since I've recorded the last part of the video, but I'm back and hopefully we'll have some progress now. Okay, do we have anything interesting down here yet? Don't see anything that looks like it could be a diamond, unfortunately. Oop. I'm gonna have a look at everything I can find, because here's something, but can't remember if diamonds can be in everything. Titanium. Okay, not that much. Oh, that's a leviathan. I do not like that. I've seen those in videos. They are really dangerous, and apparently it's getting closer. Maybe they're fighting each other. I wouldn't mind that. Why is it going in the wall? Please stay away from me. What's that? Ooh, that's probably gonna be useful. Ooh, Cyclops, that's the big ship. Ooh, only need three of those. That's gonna be very interesting to build. Please stay away from me, Leviathan. Ooh, diamond, finally. We've got another diamond. Can't remember what exactly we wanted to build. It's been a while, but I do know that the diamond was very nice. We needed that for something. All right, I have got my diamond, so I'm gonna go ahead and explore on the top of the island a little bit now. We've seen that thing already. Curious if there's anything else around here. Don't think we can get up there. That looks a little too high up. Too steep to us. Too steep for us to climb. That's really pretty in here. I don't know if it's safe, but alright. Oh, it goes down deep in here. That's kind of creepy there. Ooh, another diamond. Lithium? A lot of lithium. Good that I did check out the island a little bit, otherwise we wouldn't have found that other diamond, so that's gonna be useful and nice. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big silver cluster. Alright, it's getting dark and uh, we only have four minutes left, so I'm gonna quickly head back to the landing site and see what happens. I think I might have also left the light on in our seamoth, so I hope it's not gonna run out of battery. Is that down there at all? What is that? Did I already check there? It looks like there's an opening. I don't, I don't know. Ooh, broken thing of that. Ah, it is! Insert tablet. I don't know if we should do that. Why is it doing that sound? I feel like it wasn't there before, right? Was it? Why is that thing broken? Oh, I can scan it. Purple tablet fragment. And that's something I want to see. 
Okay, apparently it's really, really old. But... And this whole island, this whole world seems to be forgotten and left long, long ago, so... I didn't really expect anyone to have done something with it recently. Oh, it's gone. Okay. Only a little bit left until the sunbeam comes down. Let's get back there. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, that thing... I, I am not sure, but it feels like that wasn't open before. Right? Why is that thing opening? Why is it moving? What? I didn't enter it, so it's not my fault. So it's not my fault, eh? Uh, that does not look good. That looks like... It, is it... I don't think... Survivor, we see you. Man, I don't know how you held out down there. We I broke an atmosphere think and we're towards the landing site. They side. should come any closer. Down there? What do you mean you can't identify it? Oh, there. That thing's not going to survive, is it? Hold on. No turning back now. Positions, everyone. Touching down in 10, 9, 8. Why is it smeared like that? It's coming from the building? Oh, boy. Change course. Set thrusters to full. Um, not to judge or anything, but that was a little overkill, right? Um, is it going to turn back now, or is it just going to stay like that? I don't... I don't really want to go in there now. Okay, I hear some... Okay, there it goes. It's moving back. That's really concerning. Could we have turned it off? Probably not, but... Okay, let's... Let's see what we can do this time. Is that the key? Force field control... Can scan oh yes, we can scan it, okay. Kinda wanna know everything we can about this place. So it does look pretty cool, but it's also of a metal alloy with unprecedented integrity. No match okay. is found in database performing structural analysis. What's going on with this thing? That's another Okay, I I think this is gonna be too much for this episode, so I think I'm just gonna go right back out and just act like it never happened but well, not like that but yeah i'm i'm gonna have to end this episode here um that thing was creepy that sunbeam is now destroyed we don't really have much of a choice but to go ahead now i guess so yeah let's see um i hope i can upload the next episode somewhat soon but um yeah we're gonna have a look at what's in there in the next one so i guess um hopefully see you soon subscribe and like if you did like it um yeah see you in the next one i hope you enjoyed see you then and bye bye for now <laughs>